Hello, it's Sunday the 22nd of January. I'm Gamal Fambula. These are the latest ITV News headlines. Ten people have been killed and at least ten others injured after a gunman opened fire at a dance studio near Los Angeles. The attack happened just after 10 p.m. last night in Monterey Park in California. Police say they're searching for the suspect who fled the scene. Boris Johnson has met President Zelensky during a surprise visit to Ukraine. The former Prime Minister said it was a privilege to be there at the invitation of the country's president. The trip follows allegations he was helped by BBC chair Richard Sharp to secure a loan when he was Prime Minister, weeks before he recommended Mr Sharp for the BBC job. Both have denied any wrongdoing and the Cabinet Office says all the correct recruitment processes were followed. The business secretary has demanded that energy suppliers stop forcing struggling households onto prepayment meters. Grant Shapps told energy companies they should first offer money advice to help those who are behind on bills. But the government stopped short of a ban due to concerns it could lead to more bailiff action. An historic service at Westminster Abbey, a family balcony appearance plus a star-studded concert in Windsor. Those are just some of the events planned for the King's coronation in May. Buckingham Palace announced new details for the bank holiday weekend, which also includes plans for street parties and calls to volunteer in the community. And Sarah, the Duchess of York, has paid tribute to the late Lisa Marie Presley at a memorial in Memphis to celebrate her life. Fergie called the daughter of Elvis her sissy and shared an anecdote about her late mother-in-law, the Queen. Uh, so, sissy, this is for you with affection. My late uh, mother-in-law used to say that nothing can be said, can begin to take away the anguish and the pain of these moments because grief is the price we pay for love. And how right she was.